using pictures to show taking from lesson 2.1. We can use pictures to show taking from. We can circle the part we are taking from the group, then cross it out. We count how many are left. There are five flowers. Emma picks two flowers. How many flowers are there? There are five flowers. One, two, three, four, five. Emma picks two flowers, so let's circle two flowers. Those are the ones she picked. We can cross them out because she picked them and they're gone. How many flowers are there? One, two, three. Three flowers. There are seven ladybugs. Two ladybugs fly away. How many ladybugs are there now? There's seven ladybugs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two fly away. We cross them out. We count them. One, two, three, four, five. Five ladybugs are left. There are six bees. Three bees fly away. How many bees are there now? There's six bees. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three fly away. We cross them out because they flew away. How many bees are there now? One, two, three. Three bees. Bob and Dave see six cars. Dave sees five cars. Bob sees four fewer cars than Dave. How many cars does Bob see? Well, it says Bob sees four fewer cars than Dave. So he doesn't see as many as Dave. Dave sees more. And it says Dave sees five cars. There's six cars. One, two, three, four, five, six. Dave sees five. If we circle the five that Dave sees, we'll know how many are left over that Bob sees. There's only one car left. We circled the ones that Dave saw, and we can cross them out because those are the ones that Dave saw. We want to know what Bob saw. There's one. There's one car. Nine birds and some number of birds fly away. Five birds now. There's nine birds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And there's only supposed to be five birds now. So let's circle five birds. One, two, three, four, five. That's how many are supposed to be there now. How many must have flown away? One, two, three, four are outside the circle. If there's nine birds and four birds fly away, there's five birds now. One, two, three, four, five. There are four fish. Two fish swim away. How many fish are there now? Let's circle two fish. Two fish swim away, so let's cross them out. How many fish are there now? One, two, two fish. Five ladybugs, some number of ladybugs fly away, and how many ladybugs are left? How many ladybugs do we see here? One, two, three are left. If there were five ladybugs and some flew away, and now there's three ladybugs, how many flew away? We can draw two more ladybugs here. 
We can make circles for ladybugs so that there would be five. We had to draw two circles as ladybugs so we know two must have flown away, right? And now there's three ladybugs. Our next lesson is going to be model taking from lesson 2.2. We're going to use counters and dots to help us model taking from for subtraction sentences. I hope I'll see you there. Bye.